morning you guys it is almost 7 30 in the morning right now i am just drinking my coffee i just posted on instagram for the day and i was just reading my weekly pregnancy app Let me show you we are 35 weeks today only five more weeks until he's here and i could not be more excited but yeah today is tuesday um i don't have anything crazy planned i just figured i would take you through my day and just kind of vlog with you guys i asked you guys on instagram last week what kind of videos you guys want to see and mostly everybody said just like vlogs and what i eat in a day people said to show like baby stuff and whatnot so our baby shower was on saturday so i'll kind of show you some things that we got from that it was so much fun baby boy is freaking spoiled already he got so many things so um i've slowly been like organizing his room but it's still a freaking mess. I've just been so excited to like get everything ready and just finally have stuff. I can't tell you how much anxiety it has given me to not be able to just like buy everything and just have it ready. I'm such like a planner, so to like to have to wait until my baby shower I was so stressed. But we got so much stuff. I'm so freaking grateful. And I ended up ordering even more stuff off of like Amazon and then Target. So I'm pretty sure it's supposed to get here today. So I'll show you that today. But yeah, it's just going to kind of be a chill day. Just hang out with me. <laughs> I don't know. I said you wanted to see vlogs. So that is what we're going to do. I am just going to finish my coffee. And I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, I am just about to make breakfast because I'm getting very hungry. So I'm gonna eat breakfast before I work out this morning. But I wanted to show you what I am making. So I'm gonna do um, a breakfast burrito. So I'm just gonna use one of these carb balanced tortillas, some cheese, just an egg, just one egg. I'll probably do like one sausage and then one piece of bacon. And yeah, super easy breakfast to make. Okay guys, here is my breakfast burrito. So I'm just gonna have that. And then when I went to the store yesterday, I found these ratio keto friendly yogurts. And this is the flavor strawberry. So I'm gonna test this out today. And then I'm just gonna add some blueberries in it. So that is what I'm having for breakfast. Okay, so instead of doing like a traditional workout <laughs> this morning me and chase are just gonna take the dogs on a walk around the neighborhood which sounds oh speaking of dog which sounds so much better than lifting weights this morning because i am not feeling it he's just showering right now i'm gonna go chase is just showering right now but i'm gonna go change really fast and then yeah we're gonna just go on a little family walk Okay, so I just threw on a hoodie really fast and some leggings. Nothing too special <laughs> to go on our walk. I'm gonna come home and shower and get ready anyway, so. Something comfy, it's kind of cold outside, so I think it's like 55 <laughs> right now. So just something warm to wear. But I am in baby's room, as you can see, and I, and I just wanted to show you guys what a freaking mess it is. I haven't put like any of his clothes away from his baby shower. Well, I hung up some that were already on hangers, but I like, <laughs> I need to wash them all, obviously. So I don't want to put them away and then have to pull them out to wash them again. So I think I might just leave them all out and then wash them all at once. But yeah, let me, let me show you what a mess his room is. Not like that bad, but <laughs> like his dresser is covered in clothes. All of this. 
his cute little playmat his little auntie got him we have his crib with some newly added stuffed animals and this cute little safari boppy lounger that my friend got him and then all these diapers and wipes and then i just have this cute little wrap and then like a car seat cover because it's gonna be cold once he's born we also have another boppy it's like the one that like wraps around you and then just some more of his clothes we did a diaper raffle which was honestly the best thing ever like we got so many freaking diapers so if you are having a baby and you're doing a baby shower do a diaper raffle because even just like these little things of diapers like we got so many of those and people just like brought them and then brought another gift with them so such a good idea but yeah this is where we're at <laughs> right now i tried to organize these into like so i can kind of see like long sleeve stuff that's like way too big that won't fit him until like he's a year old but these are all like his long sleeve like onesies and sleepers lots of swaddles in here and then just like some sleep sacks and then just like short sleeve swaddle or <laughs> short sleeve onesies and then in his drawer it's literally such a mess he has like some little pants um socks lots of bibs under here and then this drawer is just kind of like a mixture of things like i have some little receiving blankets right here for him and then this is just stuff that like gotten from like the free like registry bags from like target and walmart and stuff so that's just kind of all thrown in there and then he's got some shampoo and conditioner my cute aunt got him this little bath and then some towels like little hooded towels some washcloths so and then this is just like the little boppy cover to go over it some little books and then this thing baby delight i don't know but like it just like folds up and it's like a little portable bassinet so that's cool but yeah, yeah that's a little preview of some of the stuff that he got i am just waiting for chase to get out of the shower and then we are just gonna go on our morning family walk Okay guys, so it's been a little bit since I saw you last. You saw I went on a little walk. Actually, it was kind of long. We ended up walking 1.76 miles, so probably not that long to some of you, but I just waddle all the time, so <laughs> it was a little harder for me. Yeah, just been hanging out. I'm about to get ready for the day. It's 10.45 right now. I don't really have anything like that I need to do today our room's kind of a mess so I need to pick that up and then I need to film some stuff for Instagram stories but other than that it should just be kind of a chill day so I am just gonna get ready really fast do my makeup and I will see you guys in a little bit okay guys so I just finished getting ready for the day and one of my Amazon packages came. One of the packages came. I still have another one coming and then I have more stuff from Target coming. So I just thought I would show you really quick what was in here. So it's a little bit of like both baby stuff and then postpartum stuff that I ordered just kind of for, my, for myself. So the first thing I got is this little Remedies new baby essentials kit. So it has a bunch of different like medicines so it has saline spray and drops, infant fever pain reliever, gripe water, gas relief drops, and then a little thing of butt paste. We got a huge thing that I have in his dresser, but I figured this would still be nice to just like keep in his diaper bag if we need it when we're out and about. So that is everything that came in this. And I also ordered myself one of these milk savers. So I saw... I mean, Olivia Zappo on YouTube talking about this. So basically you just put this in like on the other side in your bra and it catches all the milk that leaks out so you don't waste anything. So I'm excited to try that. Let me open it and see what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Um, I know a lot of women use like the Haka pump but after watching Olivia's video she said she prefers this one 
since you don't like have to hold it and you could honestly just like put it in your bra and just like walk around that way you don't have to like hold another pump and like suck it on you can just like set it in there so super excited to have that i also got these little these little scalp scrubs all the videos i watched said to get some type of like brush to brush his hair after the bath or whatever just to prevent cradle caps so i got some of these it comes with three different ones and then i also got this like for boogers for his little nose so you don't have to use your fingers <laughs> so i got one of those and then i got one of the nose fritas as well so that's coming in the other package but i just saw a lot of good reviews on that so i picked up one of those and then i ordered one of these mirrors to go in the car just so i can see him when we're driving i ordered some of this nipple cream so many of you guys recommended to get some type of like nipple balm or cream just so like when i'm done breastfeeding or whatever um, it'll help just like soothe it. So a lot of you guys recommended this one. So I just ordered that. And then I got one of these thermometers. Just the ones that you can like put on their head. And I ordered one of these little pillows for his head. Just so it doesn't like his head doesn't go flat. So we'll see we'll see how i i don't know i am a first time mom so i didn't really know everything that i needed to order i just felt like i needed to like over order and have things ready to go just in case and then for me postpartum i ordered myself some of these discreet underwear things i got a size large i didn't want to do like a small medium because i didn't want them to be too tight and uncomfortable because these are already going to be uncomfortable but from all the videos i watched everybody recommended these over the ones that like the hospital gives you so i got two things of these because i didn't know how much i was going to need so got some of those i also ordered his diaper bag off of amazon this was a super good deal i think it was only like 35 dollars, and then they had like a coupon i think it was like 30 percent off so such a good deal it has so many storage things so it has these clips on the back so you can clip it onto the stroller when we are out and about i just got a gray one uh, because chase obviously has to use it too so i didn't want to get a super girly one and then i obviously got one that's a backpack so it's easier to carry around and i did a lot of research and i just i'm sorry i could not justify spending like a hundred dollars on a freaking diaper bag i <laughs> I don't even spend that much on like a bag for myself so I just felt like I should find a cheaper alternative and this one is actually really cute they had different colors too and it has so much storage so like here's the inside of one of the pockets there's pockets on the side one is for wipies so you can just grab your wipies really fast it comes with a little changing pad some more pockets chase already put some little diapers in here but then it has like this huge pocket too it really has pa like pockets everywhere it has this little pocket and then this front one here is has like insulated pockets so you can put like your bottles and stuff in there and then just like this front pocket that also unzips that I'm probably gonna just keep like my phone in. I just wanted one that was big enough that like I could also keep my stuff in and then of course his stuff as well. And this one's perfect. It's just like a neutral color so that me and Chase both can wear it. But yeah, for 30 bucks off of Amazon. Like I said, I'm a first time mom so I didn't really know what I was gonna need, what I wouldn't need. So I just kind of buying everything that I think I'm gonna need yeah i'm <laughs> starting to stress a little bit because i just like want to make sure i have everything i know that like as long as he has like a place to sleep clothes food he'll be good but i'm just an anxious soon to be mama that just wants to have everything prepared <laughs> so hopefully you guys i don't know like seeing this i know some of you on instagram said that you wanted to see like more baby stuff and things like this not just keto related videos so i figured i would just kind of do it all in one 
But yeah, that was that. I'm hungry, so I'm going to go make some lunch. I'll take you guys to do that and show you what I eat. But yeah, that is my first Amazon order. <laughs> Okay, I'm in my messy room, so please ignore it. But I wanted to show you guys really quickly the bassinet that we got for him. I guess like playpen, play yard? I don't even know what it's called. That has like a bassinet on top. So let me show you that really fast. Like I said, please ignore how messy my room is. But here it is. So here's his little play yard. It comes with this cute little organizer where you put like diapers and wipes and everything. And then on top, it just has this little changing pad and then next to it it has his little bassinet the only bad thing that i read about these is that they don't have like a sheet that can go over them you just have to like wash it with soap and water so we will see how that goes but yeah here it is okay i am in the kitchen i'm about to make lunch i'm just gonna keep it super simple and easy for lunch so i think i'm just gonna do a chicken bacon salad. I would boil some eggs and add that in there, but I am way too freaking hungry to wait to boil eggs. So let me show you what I'm gonna use. So we went grocery shopping yesterday, so I just picked up some more of this Butter Bliss lettuce. This is my favorite kind of lettuce. I just got more of the pulled rotisserie chicken, and then I picked up some of this bacon, and then I'm just gonna use some of this cheese. So. Super easy lunch, but I'm just gonna make this really fast because I am starving. Okay, so I just finished my lunch, but I want something sweet. So I wanted to show you what I'm gonna eat really fast. So I've talked about these before. I don't know if I have on YouTube, but I definitely have on Instagram before. So it is just the company Num Gourmet Desserts. They're actually here in Utah, but they just came out with a bunch of their fall desserts. So they sent over their pumpkin snickerdoodle cookie pumpkin chocolate chip cookie and then salted caramel turtle brownie i've tried all of them and they are so good the brownie is by far my favorite it's so freaking delicious but i am gonna have just one of these pumpkin cookies i do have a discount code with them so i will leave that on the screen and then i will link it below too just in case you guys want to shop because they do ship these so yeah <laughs> I am back in baby's room. Other half of my package came, so I wanted to show you everything else that I got. <sighs> I'm so out of breath, oh my god. I cannot breathe with pregnancy. Um, okay, so I got the Freedom Mom Perry Bottle, the upside down Perry Bottle. Seriously, like every freaking video I've watched about postpartum, they've said to get one of these the hospital will provide you with one but it's not shaped like this everybody just said it's so much easier to use so obviously i picked up one of these for baby i got the frida baby medi frida so basically it's just a binky but you can put the medicine in there so like if he needs medicine or whatever you would just fill the syringe and then just like dispense it through the binky i don't know i don't know how like much i'll use this if i would even need to use this I thought it was a cool idea that way you're not just like straight shoving it in they're like sucking on the binky too so i picked up one of those like i said earlier i got one of the nose fritas so again every freaking video i have watched has said to get one of these and then i picked up so for postpartum I just picked up these Tux medicated cooling pads. They're just um, like witch hazel pads. So they just help like with the burning and everything after birth. Good videos have said that your hospital will give you some of these. I don't know. I just ordered more just to have them. So this came with 100 pads. Hopefully. <laughs> these come in handy i don't i don't really know what to expect i don't really know what my hospital is going to provide for me or what i need to provide for myself so i just kind of ordered a little bit of everything and then last these three in one breast therapy packs so again so many people recommended these for your nipples when they become raw from breastfeeding so you can use these warm or cold yeah 
that is all I have to show you guys right now. Um, I'm gonna go keep working and I will see you guys later when we make dinner. Okay guys, it has been a few hours, almost 5.30 now and I'm getting super hungry. So I thought I would attempt to make some keto nachos. I've never made them before, but I saw to be on Pinterest and it sounded super freaking good. So we are going to attempt to make it. I'm gonna preheat my oven right now at 350 but let me show you what I'm using really quick so I'm gonna use a couple of these mission car balance tortillas for the like chips um, I'm just gonna use this big thing of cheese I'm also going to cook some ground beef to put on top and then to put all over the tortillas I'm gonna do pink Himalayan salt and then just some extra virgin olive oil. So let's see how this goes. Cut up my tortillas with like a little pizza cutter and then I put some olive oil on them and then put some pink Himalayan salt as well. And then over here I am just cooking some of the ground beef. So I am gonna put these in the oven for like 10 minutes and see how they're doing and then flip them if I need to. And yeah, we'll go from there. Okay, I just took these out of the oven. Obviously, I sprinkled some cheese on top. It's not like super melty. It's more like baked. So I feel like I probably should have done it in the microwave. But it's fine. So I'm just going to move this to a plate and then put some ground beef in and some other things on top. So I will show you that. All right, guys. Here is what it looks like. I just added ground beef on top and then I did some olives. And then I'm also just going to add in some sour cream as well. But yeah, this is what they're looking like. I will let you guys know how they are. I'm a little nervous since the cheese isn't like super melted, but we will see. Okay, I am currently sitting in the floor of my gym right now, so just ignore everything behind me. But I wanted to do a little unboxing. Um, my October Keto Crate box just got here, so I just wanted to go through everything and show you what was in it this month. So for anybody that doesn't know, it is just a monthly subscription box full of keto treats. They send new ones every month. It is the freaking best. They always send so many. So let's go through and show you what they sent. So of course they always send their little pamphlet going over like everything in it, coupons, things like that. Here is this month's box. Sorry, this is just gonna be like a whole video of me just unboxing stuff, so. Okay, first thing we have is this little smart cookie. I absolutely love these. These are so freaking good. Um, this is in the flavor raspberry cream. I've never tried this flavor before, so I'm excited to see how this is, but I have had those before and they're so good. Spicy pumpkin seeds. They sent over these flock chicken chips. Never heard of these before, so I'm excited to give those a try. This is cool. So this is salted caramel flavored syrup, which I love salted caramel, so I'm excited to try this. You can just like add it into your coffee or whatever. So I'll try this tomorrow, I'll let you guys know how that is. We also have one of these Jimmy protein bars. <laughs> Keto Crate actually emailed me talking about this, but I guess this bar from Hekka, what is it, Hekka Good Foods, it leaked. <laughs> so it's kind of oily in my box, but this is in the flavor maple pecan. It looks really good. We also have this F-Bomb nut butter macadamia flavor. I'm pretty sure I've tried one of these before and they are really good. You just like tear it and just like eat it out of the packaging which I love, like almond butters and things like this, so I'm excited for that. I also have these cheese crisps. They sent over the beef stick in the flavor original, which looks really good. And then they sent over these pork belly bites, which I've never had before, so they look really good. Pork belly is actually really good, so I'm excited to try these, but yeah. That is everything they sent in this month's box. Tons of freaking yummy goodies that I am so excited to try. If you guys want, I have a discount code with them so you can sign up and save money off your first 
box, I'm pretty sure. I'll put the discount code up on the screen and then I'll leave the link below too, just in case you want to check it out or try it out. Yeah, I just wanted to pop on really fast and show you guys that. Okay, update on the nachos. I may have gone a little overboard with the salt on the tortillas because they were very, very salty. And next time I would probably just like take the chips out, put them on a plate, put cheese, and then microwave them so they were like more melted rather than like baked, if that makes sense. But overall they were really good, so I'm very impressed with myself. But I am going to end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed just coming throughout my day with me, seeing some baby stuff that I've been ordering and watching me get ready for to come. But yeah, if you aren't already following me on Instagram, make sure to follow me there and make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any other videos. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.